What is going on everybody? My name is Cody or Crazy Amazing and today we are going to be discussing whether it is worth it to try to get Dark Matter and Call of Duty, Black Ops, Cold War, you know, very long title, very long name. But before I get started and, you know, give you guys the answer whether it is worth it or not, um, it would mean a whole heck of a lot to me if you guys could hit that subscribe button or at least go watch some other video to uh, figure out whether you do like this kind of content or not because we're back at it boys upload every single day I have this whole entire week and we're gonna stay at it but yeah guys let's talk about whether it is honestly worth it to spend all these hours to max out all these guns and do all these ridiculous challenges so firstly I would like to say that me personally I will not be going for dark matter but I'm not just going to tell you guys not to because I'm not. I'm going to give you the reasons why you should and why you shouldn't. So starting off with why you should. Obviously, it's a super cool looking camo. Now, I will have some uh, gameplay on screen. Um, it's not of the actual camo in-game, but it is the camo just, you know, in like the... Uh, where you pick your camos and everything um so yeah you guys should be able to see it it um obviously looks a little different because it's not on my whole entire gun because i don't have it unlocked but yeah i mean it is honestly up to you guys i don't know about you but me personally i would rather have the zombies dark ether camo because i will also show that to you guys that looks a whole heck of a lot cooler but i just don't have the time to grind you know this game like that i will personally be going for diamond on my tactical rifles right now because of the double weapon xp i made a video about that if you guys haven't seen that I recommend you go watch it because i go in depth on why you should be playing nuketown right now and the uh, type of strategy you should be going for if you guys uh want a little sneak peek don't try to get gold guns right now just try to max them out on to another reason why you should try to get Dark Matter is you get a crazy amount of XP. And if you are able to get your guns golden now, if you guys do want to do that, if you already have your guns pretty max level to where you have all the challenges available, um, I would uh, definitely recommend if you're at that stage, you know, start, start knocking out your challenges because it is double XP, so you will be getting tons and tons of XP. Um, everybody's trying to get to max level right now. I'm currently prestige one level 38 and I've been grinding Call of Duty all day today. So, um, it is definitely possible to, uh, get up there. It just takes a long time, but, um, yeah, I do want to get to uh, max level before the uh, season actually starts and I'm on my way there. Give it another like three, four days. Cause I can't just, you know, play for 12 hours. I have things to do. Um, Obviously, I put these videos first, but the uh, I get gameplay for you guys. You know, I can't sit here all day. I gotta, you know, go to the gym, go to practice. You know, do do normal teenager things. I would see that you would feel it's necessary to get this camo. Maybe you're just somebody who likes the. I, I guess maybe you could say that you like to, you know, complete everything the game has to offer. And if that's how you are, then sure, go ahead and get Dark Matter. But. I just want to recommend doing it, guys, because um, this is kind of going to lead into why you shouldn't, but it is going to take you so, so long. Like, I've been playing all day today, and I almost have my M16 done, and it is it's just taken a ridiculous amount of time. Like, I don't know why people would want to spend so much time getting some camo, because let, let's say you do spend multiple and multiple and multiple hours, you know, it's probably going to take you close to 100 hours, more than that maybe, depending on how bad you are, to get all these camos done. So let's say you do do them. You know, there there's no saying that they don't change how easy it is to get it. Like, look at zombies. On um, the knife, I'm pretty sure it was 750 kills. Or no, 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 sorry guys. It was on the launcher, the uh, really trash launcher, the China Lake. It was... I believe like 750 critical kills and they just lowered it to 50. So you know how like ridiculous that is for the people that got the 750 kills? They did all that work, put all that time in just to have it lowered to 50. Like, do you guys want that to happen to you? I, me personally, I don't. If I do decide to go for these, you know, I'm going to get the guns 
golden that I want to get done. And then if I decide, hey, you know, like what I was going to do is, is do all the uh, ARs, get those diamond because, you know, I use ARs. ARs are probably my favorite gun. Um, I'm going to be trying to get this M16 golden. So first I'm going to go for tactical rifles because there's only like three, no, there's like four or five of them. So, I mean, I'm pretty sure there's like six ARs. So it, uh, it would just be easiest for me to do that. And that's what I'm going to be doing because I like the M16. But yeah, I mean, I just, like, like I've been saying, there just really is no reason to do it, guys, because if you are one of those people that feel like you have to do it to get the, uh, to feel like you're completing the game, you're gonna have to go to zombies, too, and you're gonna have to do all those camos, and personally, the way I would rank these is, I think that the, uh, diamond camo is, the diamond camo is absolutely amazing in this game, I think it's, Probably second best diamond camo we've ever had. I'm not going to say what the first is because that's pretty controversial. But I think it's at least the second best diamond camo we've ever had in a Call of Duty. But I don't know. It just the uh, I forgot what the name of it is. But the uh, diamond version for zombies is nuts. I absolutely love it. It's like an all purple. It, uh, it kind of looks like if you guys watched uh, Black Ops 4, basically... You had diamond, and if you um just like kept going, like if you went on like a kill streak, it would like change the color of the diamond, and it kind of looks like that when you got to like a 20 kill streak. Um, it just absolutely looks insane. So I would say, and last place is diamond, even though it's godly, and that that just goes to tell you how good the zombies camos are. And then in second place would be uh the zombies diamond, and I'm not sure what it's called. And then you have a uh, Dark Matter, which looks pretty sick, and then Dark Ether, which is at the very top. You know, Dark Matter, I'm sure when you actually have it, it looks absolutely amazing and stunning and all that fun stuff, but I am just not going to be going for it because, you know, I told you guys, it's just it's just not worth your time. I hate to tell you, but if you guys want something cool like that, go play Zombies. Zombies is amazing this year. It's so fun. I have over, I have at least, I think I have 18 hours played on Zombies, and I only have like 10 played on multiplayer, so, I mean, I have a lot of hours invested in this game, but, you know, that, that shows that I absolutely love this game, I think this is the best Call of Duty we've had in so long, and you guys, if you guys want to grind the game out, let me know down below if you guys are going to be going for Dark Matter, Make sure you guys take advantage of the XP, the double weapon XP, the double normal XP. We have that until, I believe, uh, November 30th this weekend. It actually might be the uh, the first of the year. I'm not completely sure, but do be on the lookout because I am going to be explaining the uh, how the new season is going to work. Because if you guys don't know, Cold War is going to be kind of like how Warzone was where we have seasons, but... Not really, it's a whole new system. If you guys want to see me explain all that, comment it down below. Um, if you found this video helpful on uh, whether you were kind of on the fence, if you should go for Dark Matter, you know, play zombies for it, you know, do whatever, uh, hit that like button, it means a lot. Subscribe if you're not, guys. Uh, thank you for all the support recently. We've absolutely been going nuts, and I'm going to keep giving you guys as much content as I can give you. Um... Uh, be on the lookout also because once I do get diamond, I'm going to give you uh, a whole in, like depth on how long that took and, you know, some absolutely, because obviously I'm going to be hitting clips on these kids because kids on this game are pretty trash. Not going to lie. So play Nuketown, guys. Let me know how you guys do down below. Love you all and peace out, boys.